everyone now welcome back oh i'm glad to be back i i got used to doing videos just about every day <laughs> so i kind of missed everybody i hope everyone's doing good uh beautiful day here in uh upstate new york it's about 74 degrees a little bit of a breeze it was cloudy for part of the day and now it's just fantastic out so I figured why not do another front porch haul video but I wasn't able to sit on my couch because the sun is beating directly in that spot so I had to turn around the other way and uh, just sit on the ground here so we're good that's okay I'm fine I uh, got my iced tea here and a bunch of awesome things to show you yes it is another thrift haul video from Goodwill and Salvation Army. Yes, indeed. Now, I found some pretty cool items at Goodwill, and I did have to pay up for a few of them. I'm talking, no. <laughs> I know people walk by and they hear me talking to myself and think I'm crazy, but I'm filming a YouTube video. So if you ever walk by and I'm sitting here talking to myself, you know why. <laughs> <It's fair>. All right. <laughs> okay. Now that I feel like a complete idiot, <laughs> we can move on. <laughs> Whatever. I really don't give a rat's you know what. <laughs> I just didn't want her to think, you know, that I was schizophrenic or anything like that because, you know, there are a lot of people out there with schizophrenia. I used to work with many of them. So, just wanted to put that out there. I didn't want them to be like alarmed or anything, you know? Okay, <laughs> let me compose myself. I can't even put the straw in my mouth. <laughs> Maybe I should have a cocktail or something. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay. I'm going to do Goodwill first. Now, I spent... Now, I'm going to start with the runny nose. And I didn't bring my... Stick my Kleenex in my bra or in my sleeve or in the waist of my pants. $102. And... Um... I saved $31.41 with my senior discount. So, there you go. All right. So, I have told you guys in the past that when I find items like these, brand new in the box, I buy them. Because you never know when you're going to all of a sudden need a Christmas gift for someone. Maybe, you know, somebody new to the family that you forgot about or a co-worker or something like that. Um, I won't need it for my husband's... My husband. Oh my goodness, I haven't had a husband in a million years. My son's girlfriend because they're no longer together. Uh, but, you know, who knows, maybe by December, they'll be together again. I told you, they're back and forth like I change my underwear, so you never know. So I still pick this stuff up, <laughs> you know, better to be safe than sorry. But you can see it's all brand new in there. Sorry about the glare. Yes. Uh, this is an amazing find. This is a Kristen S uh, hair curling iron, brand spanking new in the box. Never used. So, 
So I looked this up and it sells for 35 to $40 on eBay. I paid, well, 15 less 25%, okay? So that's a nice tidy little profit for this item right here. Uh, I, I just had a feeling about it and I grabbed it right away. I looked it up and I said, oh yes, you are going home with me. I mean, you can see that this was never, ever used. So, and this would also make a good gift for someone as well. If, you know, if I decided that I needed a gift for someone, but you know, we'll see what happens. Brand spanking new, couldn't believe it. Uh, got a brand new uh, jigsaw puzzle, 750 pieces. Um, of course, someone drew all over the uh, plastic wrapping, but that'll come off with some uh, nail polish remover. Yep, brand new. It is uh, free puzzle preserver inside. Well, that's cool. And this is a puzzle of the uh, Kennedy Castle in Scotland. So there you have that. Also, picked this up, brand new in the box. Thought, you know, this would make an awesome gift. Considering the majority of my subscribers are around my age or older and mostly have grandchildren because their children are grown. Um, so I pick things like this up because this would be a great gift for a grandchild. Right? Look at that. Brand new. Okay. A while back, I bought a vintage Clue game, like from the 70s, and it was missing, I think it was the candlestick. So I found a Clue game yesterday, and I picked it up for $2.67 because I wanted, it was either the lead pipe or the candlestick, but either way, I have both of them in here so I can now um, put that game on eBay because I have the piece that goes to it so that's awesome very happy about that all right come on now doesn't want to close all right uh let's see what else did I get um I have Okay, that's all Salvation Army there. This is Salvation Army. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, let me pull this box. Well, first, okay, no, we're good. All right, pull this box over. Okay, um, then I got this for myself because it looks like my binkster. <laughs> and you put a candle back here and it lights that up. So that's a me thing. I love it. <laughs> so cute. Y'all know I love Halloween. I sure do. Uh, let's see. Okay, so there's a, some things in here that are wrapped up. So I'm going to unwrap them I'll get you know what I'll do that close to last I bought a set like a I guess it because the cups are small so I'm thinking it's probably a um espresso set or something like that you know but um some of it's wrapped up. But these, on the other hand, these I love. I got the set of two of these. 
they're like um they remind me of alabaster but they're not they're regular glass but they they like they painted them with white paint like a swirling i don't know how they did it i have no idea but they are like really really cool so i got those uh let's see I did get a set of Tupperware containers. There's two of them. Uh, these would be okay, like for my son to take, um, sometimes he likes to take fruit to work. Um, I'll cut up strawberries and raspberries and blueberries and he'll take that to work. So that's like the perfect size for that. So that's another me thing. This is a me thing as well, my iced tea. I love my iced tea. I drink it all, all year long. Okay, now, I saw one of these at the old Sanborn General Store, and I never bought it, but I did buy it at the Goodwill. Um, I paid $5 and some change for it. Let me get the, well, it's taped. Now, I can't remember who the heck makes this. Um, maybe Indiana Glass, I'm not sure. So if you guys could leave that in the comments, those of you who know, I would really appreciate it. Uh, okay. In here, I got got this beautiful this is gorgeous bowl um it is from germany on it isn't that pretty i just love it it has uh, a stamp of germany and then germany is actually impressed into uh, the uh porcelain or ceramic i can't tell the difference between the two i have no idea how to tell the difference I am no expert, nor do I ever claim to be. Just saying. <laughs> then I got this beautiful set of um, Lennox bowls. Hang on, I'm just trying to untape them so I can show them both to you. If I could get the dang tape off. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I just, if I don't take it off, I'm going to forget it's there. And then when I go to wash it, it gets very hard to get the, the tape off, the packing tape that they use. If it gets wet, there we go. All right. So it's a set of two of these beautiful bowls. They're so pretty. I love the, the rose pattern on there. All right. Uh, okay, I got this set. Now this is, they're taped together, so let me, untape this. I decided at the last minute to do this haul video. I was taking the stuff out of the car. I left it in the car from yesterday and I said, you know what? I might as well just put it right up on the front porch and do the video. So I didn't take the time to like untape anything. So there's one. These are really cute. They're not old or anything. They're made by, uh, who are they made by? I don't know. But it's a tea light holder. And they're little leaves and acorns for fall. And then your tea light goes back here. So I got those. I thought they were really cute. Uh, let's see. I have bubble wrap and 
stuff. Okay. This is I, the second one of these I bought, and I just think this is absolutely gorgeous. And it is another um, Wexford candy dish. And um, I didn't untape it to check the lid, but I will now. And hopefully, oh good, no chippies. Yay, no chippies. Perfect. I love this candy dish. I have another one that I that didn't sell at a live sale, so I kept it and it's on my coffee table. And if nobody is interested in this one, I might keep this one too. <laughs> it's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. All right, then look at this. Oh boy, these would go perfect in my kitchen, but I have enough stuff in my kitchen. I can't put any more. I'm just trying to take the tag off so I can show you guys. Well, then again, <laughs> they're taped together, so. But. Uh, let's see. Where does the tape begin? All right, here we go. I think. Hi, George. I think I've got it. All right, there we go. I got this set of, of course, there was a chip on the back. These awesome um, bookends. <laughs> the fruit motif. There's where the chip was, where they were taped together. This one doesn't have any chips. These were made by Home Interiors. Someone had a price of $19.99 on them for the pair. So you got the grape, and then this one has the grape, the pear, and the apple. So there you have it. Those are awesome. I love them. They're ceramic, I think. Pretty sure, pretty sure. Then I got this beautiful set. I have two of these, so I'm not gonna pull the other one out of the box. Of these beautiful, oh my word, can you just come out of here? Now these are modern, but they're gorgeous. Beautiful lamps, table lamps. Look at that beautiful um, shade. No chips or anything. So I have two of these. It's a, a beautiful pair. I'm gonna put this one right back in the box. I got some good stuff this time around. Um, I did get um, a couple Christmas items. So, of course, you know, nah, 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 I'm not showing them. <laughs> I know, I'm a jerk. <laughs> okay. I did get uh, this little set. This is, um, I believe, Anchor Hocking Cubist Pattern. And it is, I had this set before and I sold it. Um, Cubist Pattern, the cream and the sugar. They're in excellent condition. I, there's no, no cracks, no chips. Excellent condition. I love this pattern. I think it's really cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, I got some more Halloween, you guys. You know how I am. I mean, I don't keep all of it. I got this cute little, um, goblin. 
And then this little pumpkin, ceramic. <laughs> They're so cute. Um, what's this? Oh, this is another pumpkin. This one you hang up and put a tea light in it. Look how cute. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to show you this awesome uh, set that I got. I'm gonna show you, um, I think all of it is in really great condition. Um, I do not believe, I, I don't recall finding any chips on any of the pieces that I could see. I'm on taping this right now. Hi. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good. Got a little project going on? Yeah, I'm doing my YouTube video. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right. My son's friend. All right, let me get this on tape. I'm sorry, guys. I wish I could have, should have did this, but like I said, it was not a plan. Yo, dude, how about getting a muffler job? Wasn't a planned video, so. All right. Hopefully. Okay, good. There's no chips there. Yay. Okay. Okay, so this is the set. And I love it. This is the teapot. It has a blue lid. It's got a little design on the other side. It's not marked either, so I have no idea who makes it. Um, I forgot to take the tape off the sugar. Hang on, guys. Okay, no chips on the sugar either, yay! It's like playing Russian roulette when you buy this taped up stuff. There's the cream and sugar. And then it comes with four cups and four saucers. Isn't that an adorable set? So those are small cups. So obviously, like I said, they're like Demitas cups or whatever for espresso, I'm assuming. So yeah, so I got that set. I love it. Absolutely love it. And then the last thing, oh no, I got two more things to show you. Um, I got this um, beautiful, I love when people donate the stuff with their tags on it from their yard sale and Goodwill has it priced like twice as high. <laughs> thank, thank goodness I got my senior discount. I got this beautiful yellow um, depression glass bowl with this rose pattern on there. Vegetable bowl. No chips, no cracks. It's got little bubbles in the glass here and there. So I got that. Um, I got two items that are Christmas related, so I won't show you those. The last item, which I could not get it off the shelf fast enough when I saw it. Um, it's amazing. I don't know why I, I find gorgeous religious pictures it just I don't know it happens all the time and usually I buy them and I did this time as well I'm just putting this stuff back in the box 
Um, let me show you. Now, it really needs to be taken apart and the glass cleaned on the inside. Isn't that awesome? Trying to get it so they're there. Now there's no glare. Look at that frame. This is the back and this is what I paid for it. Less 25%. absolutely gorgeous that's a big picture that's probably a 20 by 16 or something like that absolutely stunning picture and i i do want to lay it down because i don't want the wind to blow it over and smash the glass that would be my luck <laughs> Uh, so let me put this stuff back in the box and then I'll be back to show you all the goodies I got at Salvation Army. All right, now moving along. What did I spend at Salvation Army? I spent $52.91. Um, but I got some great stuff. All right, so I'm going to start with this. Um, now this is in a box. Now I don't know if it was the original box or not. Let me see. No, this is not the original box. This was a computer box actually. All right. Oh my goodness been one of those days guys um so the tags that were on sale were yellow gr um yellow green and white i think or yellow green and pink but anyways, look at this. Look at this awesome serving party tray, whatever you want to call it, Lazy Susan, with all of these little compartments. It's in excellent condition. Everything was wrapped up and stored in this box. So this is the center bowl. And then there are four of these that fit around the center bowl. And the uh, Lazy Susan spins, and it is stainless steel. Let me show you. Chromex is the maker. And I paid $4 for this set because it was half price. It was originally $8. What a fantastic deal. Fantastic deal. So, there you have that. I'm just going to set these along here for now. slide this back into the box. All right, there we go. Okay, let me close this up and move it out of my way. All right, one down and quite a few to go. <laughs> All right, I find these quite often, but not in such great condition. 
This is a vintage Tupperware Jello mold. And it is in that awesome green color. It's like a, a mint chocolate chip green. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and it's in excellent condition. Excellent condition. So I picked this up. I know there are, you know who might really like this? Oh, it just dawned on me. My girl Katie at Vintage and Vinyl. She can use this when she does her jello recipes. Oh, why didn't I think of that before? Oh my goodness. I just hope she doesn't put tuna in it. I got these, I got two of these. Um, these are serving dishes. Um, they're in excellent condition. They are called, uh, yeah. Kakuziwa, I don't know, Japan. K-A-K-U-Z-Y-U. Kakuziu. Yeah, good luck with that. There's Japan, and they're beautiful. And like I said, I got two of these, and they're both in excellent condition. I got this guy. He is just too cute. I had to get him. Um, it's from 1986 from the Critter Factory. Look at this guy. <laughs> he is so cute. Oh, I had to get him. I love him. He's awesome. I got this uh, set of uh, glasses. I'm trying to see who who makes them. I don't want to take them out of the box, but I can't really see. Um, it looks like there is a square on the bottom. I don't know. But those are awesome, right? Brand new in the package. Well, I could take it out and maybe see. Okay. Uh, China, Morning Star, no, yeah, Morning Star, I don't know, but anyways, I thought they were a nice set of glasses, and so I grabbed them, grabbed them, um, I found this Fire King in the custard color casserole dish. And I think I have a lid that will fit this, but it's that like an ivory color. It's not white and it's in really great condition. No chips, no cracks. I don't even see any like utensil marks or anything on it. So yeah, that was, that was a nice find. And then I got this um, to put away, or maybe my daughter will want it when she has a child. This is the Royal Dalton Bunnykins Bowl. It is Bone China. So I got that. And then I got a bunch of stuff that she, um, the girl uh, that worked there, she's really sweet. She, she just started working there not too long ago. And um, she was nice enough to help me uh, wrap up some of this stuff. But I got this adorable um, little planter that someone had foam in there um, for fake flowers. But 
that is adorable and so bright and cheery. I love it. No cracks, no chips. This came from Michael's. Oh, so I finally found a Martha Washington. Indeed. I already have this one, George. And I just found there was the pair. I found Martha. And Martha is usually, from what everybody says, hard to come by. But there she is in all her glory, Miss Martha. So I got those. I got this for 99 cents. Pink tags were 99 cents. This was the only pink tag I found. But look at that beautiful sugar bowl. Look at the lid. Oh, you can hear Fritz out here. I have to get him fixed because I'm very upset that he doesn't go back inside his clock. Um... I think, I don't know, I think that might be a hairline crack right there. So pretty. Then I got two of these uh, pink depression glass candle holders. No cracks, no chips. And you know, you really have to look when you're in there because they have like pieces of furniture set up throughout the store with all kinds of tchotchkes on it. And that's where these were. They weren't over in the, where all the other hard goods are. They were on random pieces of furniture throughout the store. So I really have to, you know, look good when I'm in there to find stuff. So I got those and then, I got this. This is another um, I Gottinger. Uh, Gottinger Company, I Gottinger Company. Look at this pretty picture. Isn't that pretty? I love it. I love the shape and the design. Very cool. Oh my gosh, wait till you guys see this butter dish. It is to die for. It is 24% PBO, made in Poland, and there's not a chip or a crack on it. Oh my goodness. absolutely gorgeous mm -hmm. stunning piece for a butter dish gorgeous absolutely gorgeous I got this pretty blue um, base this is on the older side It has little etched um, grapes and little like um, stems with some leaves or whatever on it. Really a pretty vase. I love the color. Look at that blue. It's not real old because it has a uh, barcode on the bottom. Greenbrier International. Is that Dollar Tree Greenbrier? I'll be damned. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Still pretty. Looks it looks like old to me. I liked it. 
Then I got, oh, nope, I can't show you that. That's Christmas. Uh, so this and the other three things in this box are Christmas related. So um, I cannot show you. I'm sorry. Um, and there's one other thing that I got there as well that is also Christmas. And it is a handmade either crocheted or knitted, but I think it's crocheted Christmas piece. That's all I'm going to tell you. So I just can't wait for the Christmas in July and to have a sale of Christmas stuff because you can't imagine the Christmas stuff that I have accumulated thrifting. Uh, yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot. So guys, I believe that is everything from this haul. I got quite a bit of good stuff, I think, and uh, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed the haul. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Thumbs up do count. They do count. YouTube notices the thumbs up. Let's people know that people are enjoying your videos. So that is very important. Also, if you are watching my video right now and you enjoyed it and you're not yet subscribed, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. I would greatly appreciate it. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Um, I have my normal, my normal Saturday sale at 3 o'clock Eastern time. So I hope I will see you all there. All right, guys, until the next one, bye for now.